What is up, everyone? We're going to have a conversation, and this is going to be about Stevie J and Faith Evans. Now, we know that a few weeks ago, there was a video that was circulating that was exclusively brought out by Tasha K on her YouTube channel, I Want With Tasha K, where Stevie J was just being extremely verbally abusive throwing and hurling accusations at faith that she cheated on him in their house and she's clearly not wanting to be bothered she's trying to cover herself with the blankets and and the covers on the bed the room didn't look like it was ready for video and ready for you know live viewers to be watching or replay viewers to be watching it's like this is their private space and he was trying to expose her and embarrass her and he was degrading her calling her the b-word saying you f my homie and all this other stuff like it was just really like is this really happening right now are we seeing two people that we see as celebrities having this type of confrontation this type of situation going on like we're actually seeing this this isn't some, this isn't some ratchet video on world star hip-hop or on tiktok or anything like that these are two people who we we know in the public eye and this is actually happening right now like is this really real she was saying i hate you here you go with your bs again clearly stevie j is trash i don't know what prompted her to marry this guy besides maybe some substances that she might have been using along with him because we know that there have been not just the allegations but she has literally been charged in the past with possession and clearly anybody that gets with this guy after what he did to Eve many years ago where he exposed I believe it was a sex tape of the two of them to get with somebody like this who's shown no class has shown that he has no respect for women to marry this guy even if it was a shotgun wedding in las vegas because i believe they they reported that they got married in a hotel room in las vegas they had on uh, track suits or joggers or something like that like it was just absolutely ridiculous but it happened so this video was exposed and then he comes out after the fact because there was a filing of divorce. He filed for divorce, but then he came out and he issued an apology. Stop having holidays, everybody. I like to make this video for my wife. A video was released last week that um that showed me like talking crazy to my wife. My wife, I'd like to apologize and say sorry that I haven't allowed somebody to come in my home and steal a computer and be able to do that to us. You're an amazing person. I'd like to apologize to your family. They don't deserve that either. Nah, she ain't she. I was just in the moment, you know, you know how us guys do. I'd like to take the time to apologize to you, Faith, and let you know I love you. I'm here for you, always, always. Okay, so after he, he's trying to declare his love for his wife and apologize, not really to her, but he's, he's kind of apologizing to the public about what he did to Faith, because you, you know, yeah, I believe if you, embarrass someone publicly then you should apologize publicly absolutely but he wasn't apologizing to her in the public he was just doing a video assuming that she was going to watch it and doing it in the public to try to win the public's favor and just trying to redeem himself trying to give himself some redeeming qualities but really this guy has no redeeming qualities we've seen how he has treated on love and hip-hop atlanta Jocelyn, they had a child together. He was extremely abusive to her verbally. Um, they have been in physical altercations. He is not somebody that is 
worthy of being a husband or even worthy of having a wife. So the fact that she married him, I don't believe that they were best friends. I believe that they knew each other, of course, but someone that's your best friend is not going to treat you that way. So this is coming from the Jasmine brand and it's reporting that now there has been an update to all of this. So according to recent reports, Stevie J has petitioned for Faith Evans to pay him monthly spousal support. So while the specific amount he's asking for is unclear, it's worth noting that Stevie J also petitioned for the judge to terminate the court's ability to award support to Faith Evans. So in other words, he wants her to pay him alimony and he doesn't want to have to pay her anything and he's also asking for her to cover both of their legal fees in this case this is crazy this guy is such a narcissist and i can say i feel sorry for her but what 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 was she on what was she thinking that this would be somebody that she was going to spend her forever days with? She should have never married this guy. You know, I, ugh, I, I just don't get it. And you know how the blogs do. They go in and they check to see if they're following each other, if they've unfollowed each other. And apparently they're still following each other on Instagram. So there has not been any filing to end the petition for divorce by either party so we don't really know what's going on but this situation is clearly nuts stevie j should have never been anyone's husband faith should have never married this guy he is trash and just the fact that he has the 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 gall to put her on blast that way do this video posted online i believe it actually was live because he said in the video you know you're on live you're on live i don't know if it was live though because i don't follow any of them on social media so i don't know if it was a live video or if he just recorded it on his phone and he uploaded it later or whatever but i don't even know if he really uploaded the video i think he said that somehow someone else got the footage because tasha k did interview somebody on her channel when she exposed that video and the guy was just talking about how he had been working with Stevie J and a group that he has, I believe, and, and it just didn't work out, but somehow he got that information. So again, I don't really know all the details about how the footage got out there, but either way, it happened. It was him. It was real. It wasn't fictional. It wasn't made up. And they are clearly still going through a divorce, but now he's wanting to receive alimony. And he's got a bunch of kids. He's He owes a lot of child support. I believe he served some time for that as well. He's trash. I I wish her the best in the situation. I hope she can get out of it unscathed. Um, but it seems like Stevie J's trying to do a can do. <laughs> He's trying to do a can do on her with this situation, but they haven't been together that long. So I don't I don't know if a judge will award him anything like Kendu Isaacs got out of Mary J. Blige. I believe she got she got the shaft as well in that situation, but she clearly seems like she is trying to just move above that situation and move beyond it and, and move on with her life. And I hope Faith can do the same thing and that she'll just say, you know what, I need to get out of here. And I hope he does not get a dime of alimony from this woman. But anyway, you guys let me know your thoughts about all of this in the comment section. And I appreciate you all liking, commenting, and subscribing. And of course, as always, I'm just being beautifully honest. Thank you so much for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And until the next time, I'm just being beautifully honest.